chain reaction in nuclear fission. When slow neutrons are bombarded on uranium, each uranium nucleus is broken into two almost equal parts and along with it enormous energy and two or three trash neutrons are emitted. If the conditions are favorable, these neutrons take part in the fission. This leads to a chain of nuclear fissions, which continues till the whole of the uranium is consumed. Thus, the energy produced keep on multiplying. We have seen that about 200 mega electron volts of energy is released due to fission of one uranium nucleus. In this chain reaction, the number of nuclei undergoing fission increases very rapidly. Hence, the energy produced acquires an enormous amount very soon. The chain reaction is a series of nuclear fissions in which the neutrons produced in each fission cause additional fissions. This chain reaction liberate tremendous amount of energy within short interval of time. But sustaining a self-propagating chain reaction is not easy in practice because the progressive chain reaction is inhibited due to the following reasons. A. Ordinary uranium consists of three isotopes, 92 uranium-238, 92 uranium-236 and 92 uranium-235. The major part of ordinary uranium is the isotope 92 uranium-238. The remaining are rare. Now, 92 uranium-238 can be fissioned only with fast neutrons, energy greater than 1 mega electron volts. When 92 uranium-235 can be fissioned with slow and fast neutrons. Neutrons having energy less than 1 mega electron volts are absorbed by 92 uranium-238 through these low energy neutrons can take part is a fission of 92 uranium-235. But the probability of their absorption by uranium-238 is much more. Thus, the fresh neutrons released in the fission of ordinary uranium being absorbed by uranium-238 are not able to continue the chain reaction. This difficulty can be removed in the following two ways. 1. The lighter isotope, uranium-235, can be separated from the ordinary uranium by diffusion method. The fission of uranium-235 is now possible by neutrons of any energy, high or low. So chain reaction continues as shown in above. 2. The second way is to slow down the neutrons by any method so that their energy remains 0.03 electron volts. This can be achieved with help of moderators which reduce the speed of neutrons very rapidly. Graphite and heavy water are good moderators. B. The second difficulty in maintaining the chain reaction is that the fast neutrons released by the fission of uranium-235 travel a distance of about 10 cm in the substance before they are slowed down and fission other nuclei. Therefore, to continue the chain reaction, the size of the fissionable substance should be bigger than a certain critical size.